Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this very exciting video of functional equation. Functional equation is f of 2x plus square root 4x square plus 1 equal to 2x over x plus 1. We will solve this functional equation using substitution method. We will do some algebraic manipulation. Then we will, we will conclude some statements. If you will observe the function, so that is 2x plus square root 4x square plus 1 is left hand side. So 2x is linear and square root of 4x square plus 1 is radical function. And right hand side you have got rational polynomial function as you can see denominator is there. Involvement of x in the form of numerator and denominator that means rational polynomial function. So let's get started this problem by substitution. I am going to substitute the bracket equal to y or t. Let me consider t. So I will write 2x plus square root 4x square plus 1 equal to t. Take away 2x to both sides. So it will become 4x square plus 1 equal to t minus 2x. So how I will substitute x in terms of t so that I can put in the right hand side. So purpose is this x square should be eliminated otherwise we cannot find out. So let's let us take the square both sides. So let me write there 4x square plus 1 whole square equal to t minus 2x whole square. So this is square, square root will be over. Left hand side we will be having 4x square plus 1 and if I will open the whole square, so it will become t square plus 4x square minus 4tx. Now you can see this 4x square term will get cancelled out. So if I will take 4tx to the left and rest of the terms to the right, then here we can find out x in terms of t. If it is not possible, then we cannot do like that. So t square minus 1 over 4t will be having. So x is t square minus 1 over 4t. If we are not able to cancel this 4x square from both sides, then this method won't be applicable. So it is only possible because of we are capable of cancelling 4x square both sides. So that equation converts into the linear form and now we can easily write x in terms of t. Now this x I, I will put in the right hand side. So let's put left hand side will be as you consider t, so it will be t equal to. Now 2x, x means what we calculated, we will put here t square minus 1 over 4t divided by x plus 1. So t square minus 1 over 4t plus 1. Now we have to simplify to find out fx. Now how we will simplify? See denominator you can see. Let's take the common denominator in the denominator. So it will come out 2 t square minus 1 over 4t over t square minus 1 plus 4t. This will be our denominator's numerator and denominator will be 4t. I just made the numerator denominator common denominator 40 or you can consider LCM in the denominator. So that 40, 40 will get cancelled out. So it will come out 2 t square minus 2 over t square plus 40 minus 1. And your left hand side is f of t. Now I will swap, I will substitute x in place of t. So I will write 
in place of t i am writing x so fx will be equal to 2x square minus 2 in the numerator and in the denominator it will come out x square plus 4x minus 1. This is the way we can find out fx. Now one important point. If you have not got this 2 then what you will do? Think about that. If this 2 is not there then what you will do? Okay. Let's take now the problem which I asked to you. In the, I guess the last two videos means the third last video of the functional equation. Equation was fx minus fx plus 1 equal to fx times fx plus 1. So if you will consider this functional equation, then you have to find out the value of fx. fx won't come automatically. Means by substitution, you cannot find out fx in terms of function. So you have to think about whether it will be algebraic function, whether it will be trigonometric function, whether it will be exponential, logarithmic, rational, polynomial, any function. So you have to think about that. See, I considered fx is equal to 1 over x. Then fx plus 1 will be equal to 1 over x plus 1. Now substitute value here. You can think like that 1 over x minus 1 over x plus 1. So if I will simplify it, so x plus 1 minus x over x into x plus 1. Now you can see this term will get cancelled out. So what is left? 1 over x into x plus 1. Or you can write like this 1 over x times 1 over x plus 1. And what is 1 over x? That is fx. And what is 1 over x plus 1? That is f of x plus 1. This is what we considered earlier. Now it is coming in terms of product. So the meaning is. If you will consider fx as inverse function or you can say hyperbolic function fx is equal to 1 over x then this condition of functional equation will hold true. This is how we will solve such kind of problems. I can give you one more problem. Think about this fx minus f1 over x equal to 2. Think about this. You can find out, you can think about exponential also, you can think about logarithmic also, you will get the function value. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked this video. This video was meaningful for you. Thanks a lot. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Please give like impression. Thank you.